I'm going to take you down the accelerated sequential antidepressant protocol. So I'm accessing this through my EHR and I'm a primary care physician who has a patient coming in with depression. One thing that I have access to is the medication library where I have a quick glance at the seven essential meds that I need to effectively treat outpatient depression. I click on any of the green links. I can see the titration, side effects, even the FDA label. Let me hit close. More importantly is if I have my visit type. So the patient's coming in for the first time, initial management. And let's say I already have the PHQ-9, so I don't need to use this calculator. And instead, it's actually going to be plugged in directly from my EHR that I have a PHQ-9 between 5 and 14. My next step is assessing the suicide risk. If my patient has passive suicidal ideation, I get a little note that they're okay for outpatient treatment if they have support. I do a bipolar screen. Let's say they're negative. And then let's say they're 23 years old. So over here I get a reminder of a black box warning of increased suicidality. I warn my patient about that and I get my first step, sertraline or psychotherapy. I can click down for more details on which one to give. And I can even click on my assessment plan, which can auto-generate a note that can then be populated inside the EHR.